हे गाइस तो चलो आज बात करते हैं ब्यूटिफुल क्वेश्चन कि एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस वाई स्क्वायर इज गिवन इक्वल टू सेवन एक्स क्यूब प्लस वाई क्यूब इज इक्वल टू गिवन टेन देन यू हैव टू फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स प्लस वाई गिवन द कंडीशन दैट बोथ एक्स एंड वाई दे आर रियल नंबर सो हाउ यू आर फाइंड इट दिस अ वेरी ब्यूटिफुल प्रॉब्लम एंड मोस्टली आस्ट इन कॉम्पिटेटिव एग्जामिनेशन तो इसका बड़ा सिंपल सा मेथड है एंड दैट सिंपल मेथड इफ यू अपलाई यू बी एबल टू सोल्व ऑल ऑफ दीज टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन so what do you have to do you have to just assume x plus y the value which you have to find you, we don't know the value so we'll assume just some value like k n kuch bhi maan lo so say for example we assumed k now whatever is given to you try to reach from this equation to this point either to the square or to the cube part to pehle square pe pahunchte hain aasan hai to let's do squaring both side so we have got x plus y ka whole square barabar k square now x plus y whole square is nothing but x square plus y square plus 2xy is equals to k square okay now x square plus y square is already given 7 so you get 7 plus 2xy is equals to k square now you can send this 7 to this side so you will have 2xy is equals to sorry k square is equals to k square minus 7 and then 2 will go to the denominator so you will have xy equals to k square minus 7 divided by 2 now you might be thinking sir why did you find the value of xy xy mein aisa kya prem tha jo aapne xy ki value nikali तो एक्चुअली आई नो दैट फ्रॉम दिस इक्वेशन आई हैव टू रीच टू दिस इक्वेशन आल्सो अब यहां क्यूब में भी तो जाना होगा ना तो फॉर गेटिंग इनटू द क्यूब आई हैव टू डू व्हाट मेरे को वापस से क्यूब करना होगा सो देयर आल्सो आई विल रिक्वायर द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स वाई इसीलिए आई फाउंड द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स वाई तो लेट मी शो यू इंस्टेड ऑफ मी टेलिंग दैट यू फील इट मोर लेट्स डू क्यूबिंग बोथ साइड तो एक बार तो यहां पर स्क्वायरिंग किया हियर वी डिड अ स्क्वायरिंग बोथ साइड नाउ वी आर डूइंग क्यूबिंग बोथ साइड ओके सो एक्स प्लस होल क्यूब इज इक्वल टू के क्यूब आई क्यूब डेट बोथ साइड तो आई गेट ए क्यूब प्लस बी क्यूब प्लस द फॉर्मूला इज थ्री ए बी इन टू ए प्लस बी दैट इज द फॉर्मूला थ्री ए बी इन टू ए प्लस बी एंड दैट इज इक्वल टू के क्यूब करेक्ट नाउ एक्स क्यूब प्लस वाई क्यूब वैल्यू यू नो दैट ये इट इज गिवेन टेन प्लस थ्री एक्स वाई वैल्यू डू नो दैट तो थ्री इन प्लेस ऑफ एक्स वाई वट यूल राइट यूल राइट दिस वैल्यू के स्क्वायर माइनस सेवन डिवाइडेड बाई टू k square minus 7 divided by 2 i'll write it on the next slide don't worry x plus y is what so we have already assumed x plus y equals to k so i'll write it as k and that entire thing is equals to k cube okay so let me write it on the next slide also so we have got a 10 we have got a 3 into k square minus 7 by 2 into k and plus is equals to k cube so we have got a 10 plus we have got a 3 times k square minus 7 divided by 2 into k is equals to k cube this is what we have got all together okay fine so now let's uh, do the simplification 2 will be taken as lcm will go to the this side so it will become 2 into 10 20 plus 3 will get multiplied and k will also get multiplied so k getting multiplied to k square will make it k cube and 3 getting multiplied to this term will make it 3k cube k getting multiplied to minus 7 will make it minus 7k but 3 multiplying with 7 will make it minus 21 so minus 21k and then 2 is the lcm so 2 in the denominator equals to k cube now this 2 will go to the side so this will be 20 plus 3k cube and minus 21k equals to 2k cube so now very easily you are able to see that this 2k cube should go to this side it should get subtracted so 3k cube minus 2k cube you will have k cube minus 21k plus 20 equals to 0 so finally what we have got Now what a cubic equation? Now cubic equations are generally tough, but here it won't be tough because otherwise these type of questions won't be able to solve. Okay, so here very easily you you can see that k equals to one is satisfying it. See here, so if you put one one minus one minus twenty one plus twenty, so if it is coming equals to zero, this means k equals to one is a is is a zero of this equation. So if k equals to one is the zero of the equation, this means k minus one must be a factor. We always bring this zero to the left hand side, and that becomes the factor. So if k minus one is a factor of this equation for this cubic equation, this means k minus one must be able to divide this k cube minus twenty one k plus twenty. So you have to divide it. So k, the first term divides the first term. So you go to the rough. K cube will divide this k. You will get k square. So you will write quotient k square, and this k square gets multiplied to both the term. So k square into k, you have to write k cube. K square into minus one, you'll have to write minus k square. Then you will subtract it, so minus, and this will become plus. Because whenever we subtract, the sign gets reversed. So k cube minus k cube getting cancelled. Now 
you don't have a k square in 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 this first line to actually cancel the this k square so you will write this k square as it is but with a sign of plus because the second sign we always take into consideration so this will come as plus k square and this minus 21k will come as it is and then this plus 20 will also come as it is this plus 20 okay now again what you will do you will take this part k square into the rough k square and you will divide it with the first term k so k square divided by k you will have k yeah now so this k will come as the next part of the quotient now k into getting multiplied by both so k into k that is k square k into minus 1 that is minus k i'll write it here so we have got a k square minus 21k and then we have got a plus 20. so this k getting multiplied to the first term it will be k square and then k getting multiplied to minus 1 it will be minus k now again reversing the sign so if here you have no you you don't have any sign so we'll put a you'll assume the sign to be plus and hence opposite of it will be minus here there is a minus so we'll opposite it plus again getting cancelled now minus 21k and you have a plus k so minus 21k and then plus k will finally bring you minus 20k and this plus 20 is as it is so again you'll take the first term that is minus 20k and that divided by this uh, this this first term k so you'll get divide you'll get minus 20 so now the quotient comes as minus 20 so this minus 20 k minus 20 if you'll get multiply so you will write minus 20 k and then minus 20 into minus 1 will be plus 20 reversing the signs this will become plus this will become minus cancelled cancel gone so finally what you have got for this cubic equation this k cube minus 21 k plus 20 for this what you have got this k cube minus 21 k plus 20 this has got you k minus 1 into k square minus sorry plus k minus 20 plus k minus 20 now again so this value we know that the 0 is 1 here we'll have to factorize it so quadratic factorization middle term splitting we know so 20 has to be broken into two parts so that we get a 1 so i can break it using 5 and 4 5 4 is a 20 and using 5 and 4 i'll get 1 how i can write it as 5k minus 4k 5k minus 4k is k and the first term will be k square as it is and then last term is minus 20 taking common from both of them i'll get k we have a k plus 5 from these two terms i can take minus 4 common i have a k plus 5 now, look, here k plus 5, k plus 5, I can take common again k plus 5. Remaining kya bacha? k minus 4. And this k minus 1 is obviously there. So, look, for dhyan se, for this cubic equation, I got 3 zeros. 3 zero I have total. Because if we equal to 0, then I got 3 zeros. Kaun -kaun se? k equals to 1, pehle wale se. from second, I get k equals to minus 5. And from the third, I got k equals to 4. Okay, 3 zero mil gaya. Now, k tha kya? So what was k in the starting? So obviously the k was the value of x plus y and x plus y value hi humse mangi jari thi. So we got three values of x plus y. Those three values are 1, another value minus 5 and another value 4. Are all of them real numbers? Absolutely yes. So hence we got three values of x plus y, 1, minus 5 and 4. And hence we have been able to solve this question. So I hope you like this question. Do let me know in the comment box ki maza aya ki nahi and be ready for the next challenge here we go so guys i hope you loved and enjoyed the problem and if that is the case so i would like to give you one more problem as a challenge which you should solve and send me the answers what do you say so if, if you are ready here is the problem in this problem what you have to do you have to solve this question and write the answers in the comment box if i get a lot of right answers then i'm very very happy i'll be very happy to see all of you solving these challenging questions and in case if you're not able to solve, just write down in the comment box that, sir, I'm not able to solve it. Kindly help or kindly guide. I'll be very happy and uh, based on the responses given by you guys in the comment box, I'll be bringing a solution video for this particular question in the next session. Okay. So I hope you loved and enjoyed this video. So if you, if that is the case, please write down in the comment box your valuable feedback. Do like the video and subscribe the channel for more such beautiful contents. See you in the next video. Thank you.